Hello, welcome to the IT Academies. In this video, I'll demonstrate how to use the sort feature in Excel to optimize your spreadsheet. Sometimes we enter data in no particular order, and we may need to later arrange them in some kind of order. To do this, we need to use the sort feature in Excel. Let's see how it works. The information you see on this spreadsheet is not organized in any particular way. So we're going to try to sort it. Now we will sort it alphabetically by name to start with. So if we want to sort it, the first thing you have to do is highlight the entire table. When you've highlighted the table, you click on the data tab and then you go to the sort and filter group and then you click on sort okay so once you click on sort this dialog box will appear and then you have to make some choices here so what do you want to sort by we want to sort this information by name alphabetically so sort by what column by name and do you want to sort it a to z that is ascending or z to a so I want to sort it Z to A and then I click on OK. You see that the information has been sorted alphabetically here, starting from A. OK, so if we decide that we want to sort it alphabetically the other way around, we also click on data and then sort name. And then we decide to make it Z to A and click OK. You see that it starts from Z, ends up with A. Okay, so the whole table has been reorganized. Let's sort by another column also and see. You highlight the entire table and then you click on data and sort. So we're going to sort it by division. So I click division. This is the division column. I click on division and I select A to Z and then I click OK. You see that division has been organized here. The whole table has been arranged or sorted by division alphabetically. OK, so now what if the column you want to sort has numeric values or numbers? What you have to do is also highlight the entire table. And then you click on data and sort. And then you decide to select salary. Salary is the column that has numeric value. So I select salary. And then because the contents of this column are numeric, it's not asking me for A to Z. It's rather asking me if I want the smallest to largest. So let's select smallest number to largest. You see that the smallest number comes first and the largest comes last. Let's do it again. Sort and then we make it largest to smallest. And then click OK. You see that the largest number is on top and the smallest is at the bottom. OK, so that is how we sort data in Microsoft Excel. I hope you like this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also type your comments in the comment section below. I would like to hear your thoughts on the video or any related subject. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Bye for now.